The drain that was here didn't go anywhere. It was just a, uh, a capacity drain, whereas there was just a hole dug underneath with some stone. But over time, what happens is if it doesn't flow to somewhere, soil or, or different, whether it's leaves or whatever, will collect in there and it reduces the volume over time, over time, over time, you get less capacity of that type of system. So what we've done is we've taken a whole big chunk of the floor out here and then dug down and filled it with an enormous amount of stone and then we set up our, our, our speedy drain that's going through this step to the inside and then tying in with a T right here to our system. So any water collecting out here or even coming up hydrostatically will flow through to the system, go to the pump and then be pumped up out away from the house. So it'll completely solve the outside problem with the inside drainage. This is the front of the house. We just went through how we reset up the outside drain on the back side of the house. If you see here, we have an old drain, pretty rusted out. And if you look, coming underneath the steps, the drain flowing over into it from here, we've replaced it with our speedy drain. Now it has tape on it. That's so when we re-cement over top of it, we don't get any cement in, into the drain itself. And then once it's all re-cemented, we pull the tape off of it. We're taking this outside drainage and once again, tying it into the inside drainage. So no amount of water here will ever build up that will actually flow inside of the house like it was prior. One of the, one of the main reasons that they were getting basement waterproofing. What I understand is that from the homeowners that they got water about this high in the basement after a good heavy storm. So with our system, it's going to be able to handle that and even much more. And then the outside here, which was problematic, is now tied into the enormous amount of drainage that we've installed around the entire perimeter. This basement is now in fabulous shape. It's going to stay dry regardless of the size storm.